Most of life is habitual. You do the same things you did yesterday, the day before, and every day for the last month. Habits, good or bad, make you who you are. The key is controlling the unhappy ones. If you know how to change your bad habits into healthy habits, then even small efforts can create big changes. A habit begins with a number of beliefs that together create a strategy. If repeated often enough, the strategy becomes a habit. Weight control is all about creating a number of beliefs that you can live with forever. You have seen over the past weeks on your TLS weight loss solution journey that incorporating small changes has led you to adapt healthy lifestyles, leading you closer and closer to your goal. Creating healthy habits along the way ensures that when you reach your goal, you stay there. There are many different techniques you can use to re-engineer different aspects of your life that you're not happy with. Two major components that, when made into habits, can drastically improve your lifestyle are improving your nutritional behaviors and sustaining consistent exercise. Improving your lifestyle and creating new, healthy habits takes time, as you have witnessed over the past weeks on TLS. Sometimes someone decides to make a change in their life and does it all at the snap of their fingers while others take a slower approach. This depends upon your personality, as well as how badly you want to make a change. It's said that it takes a minimum of 21 days to create a habit. Again, this depends upon the individual and their desire to create the habit. Either way, it doesn't happen overnight. It takes consistent effort. One tip would be to focus only on one or two changes for a few weeks. Stay consistent with these so they are conditioned to become new, healthy habits. The point of a habit is that it doesn't require thought. You just do it. Variety may be the spice of life, but it doesn't create habits. If you're going to commit to going to the gym, go every day for your first 30 days. Going a couple times a week will make it harder to form the habit. Activities you do once every few days are trickier to lock in as habits. Also, stay consistent with the time at which you do something. When exercising, try to do it at the same time for the first few weeks. When certain cues like time of day, place, and circumstances are the same in each case, it's easier to stick to and become a habit. Using triggers may come in handy when establishing these new behaviors. A trigger is a short ritual you perform before a particular habit. For example, if you want to wake up earlier so you can exercise before going to work, this might mean jumping out of bed as soon as you hear the sound of the alarm. If you want to quit drinking sweetened beverages, try snapping your fingers every time you feel the urge to go for that drink. Be sure you replace lost needs. This is known as bait and switch. If you are giving up something in your habit, make sure you are adequately replacing any needs you've lost. If you opened up your computer and started removing hardware, what would happen? Chances are your computer wouldn't work. Similarly, you can't just pull out habits without replacing the needs they fulfill. If watching television provides you a way to relax, you could take up meditation or yoga as a way to replace that same need. If you drink soda with dinner and like the fizz it provides, you can drink carbonated water with fresh fruit slices in it. Also, don't expect all your attempts to change habits to be successful immediately. Try your best, but expect a few bumps along the way. Remember, you're looking for progress, not perfection. If you start thinking negative thoughts, use the word but to interrupt it. For example, I'm not good at this, but if I work at it, I will get better. Or I do not like vegetables, but I know eating them will help me reach my goals, and there must be some I will enjoy. Write down your new, healthier behaviors. Don't leave commitments floating around in your mind that you try to remember. Write them on paper. This does two things. First, it creates clarity by defining what your change means to you. Second, it keeps you committed since it's easy to dismiss a thought, but harder to dismiss a promise printed in front of you. This is where both journaling and having written out goals come into play. It's also important to associate with role models. Spend more time with people who model the habits you want to mirror. The truth is, birds of a feather flock together. This goes along with the saying, if you can't change your friends, well, change your friends. Now, I'm not saying that you need to ditch all of your friends who choose a less healthy lifestyle. I'm just saying be aware of your surroundings and what influences you. You will be surprised at how inspiring you can be. You probably have noticed the changes in your energy levels after you started eating healthier and providing your body with the nutrients it requires. Remember how your clothes started feeling looser on you after just a short time of improving certain behaviors and breaking old habits? 
and this is just the beginning. Don't worry about all the things you should have as habits. Instead, steer your habits towards your goals and the things that motivate you. Lastly, get leverage. Do something like give a buddy $100 with the condition to return it to you only when you've completed a few weeks of your new healthy habits without fail. Make a public commitment to everyone you know that you're going to stick with this. This includes on social media. Offer yourself a reward if you make it a month. Just remember, never reward yourself with unhealthy foods. Rewards may provide you with that extra push that you need. Breaking bad habits and creating new healthy ones is not always easy, but you can do anything you set your mind to. It doesn't matter what you are or what you do. You absolutely positively have the power to change. Please review your TLS health guide and journal for a list of the top 10 habits that will help you turn your dream of weight loss into a reality.